fire or electric hot plate. Okay. Other questions? Um, wow, you could really learn all about all of these characters here. But I don't know. Like, you probably use them for the remainder of the DLC, if not, uh, you know, maybe when you exit the Mojave. I don't know. I don't know how it ends, but... Um, hmm. Uh, we don't really need to know. Is anyone else alive around here? Uh, alive see about that. is a tricky word. The locals. He might mention the, the other people, callers that we already have. Not but sure it applies to them. We'll see. They're a little uncivilized. They don't talk much, as in at all. <sighs> you forgot the word for hit for this object. <laughs> Um, where do they come from? Friend, there's more mysteries in heaven and earth. Wait, no. There is more between heaven and earth. Oh, forget it. I'd sooner ask what makes me an undying son of a bitch than spend any thought as to why they crawl to life here. I'm counting myself lucky. I still have my faculties. They sure don't. Then again, they may not have had the focus I do. Focus. Always had the Sierra Madre to keep my mind occupied. Most folks, they don't have the same drive, the same need. Not worth my time. Pretty much ghost people before the bomb. Now ghost people after. Ghost people after. Have you tried to deal with them? Tried talking to them, bribing them, leaving food. Nothing. We basically just blow their heads In the off. Years since they haven't That's how we deal with approach, them. But I sure have. They catch you, they drag you into the cloud, and you're not coming back out. After that, having your necktie go off. Okay, now I want to go into, like, all the cloud areas. Stay out of their way. They don't die easy. Okay. Um... We already know about the cloud and the vending machines. We already know about the villa and all that stuff. Um, uh, so let's go. Let's take off. Wait, wait, actually, what, um, real quick. Didn't think much about What weapons do you use? Not one for fighting, if we can avoid it. Still wasn't bad at the pistol Yeah, we can range. give him the pistol. And over the years, I've learned how to handle Wait a minute. Knife. Christine has and it. Explosives Never mind. a bit. A bit. <clears throat> Made a lot of mistakes along the way. Still have my fingers, though. Okay. Alrighty, we're gonna have to find some stuff off the uh, ghost people's bodies. Uh, I also need to find a tin can somewhere. It's going to be sad to leave the residential district. Where? I think there was a tin can over here. Yeah. Okay. All right. Let's see if we can make a Sierra Madre Artini. Artini? Yes. Sierra Madre Artini. Um, oh, you need barbecue crisp? Really? It just said any junk food. Uh, HP, endurance, strength. That's pretty good. I like it. Alright, well, we'll keep an eye out for those. Um... So pretty much we're done here. Now all we have to do is go to the fountain and um, talk to Father Elijah and get the next part of this quest going. Uh, but now we can travel through uh, Toxic Cloud and not have to worry about um, left a lot of traps. really getting damaged too much. Sometimes I forget where they are. Don't dive in for too long. Only so much I can do to help. But we're fine. Whoops. I'm a poor man. I need all these chips, alright? Don't judge me. Uh, I should probably heal up a little bit there. Because we still need to find the rest of Dean's stash and whatever cards we can find. Um, I don't know how, how you check to see how much you have currently, but... Don't dive in for too long. Only so much I can do to help. Let's go up in here. 
Stimpak. Rataway? Yes, sir. I'll take that. Uh, Medex? Sure. Dean's Secret Stash. Here we go. Hey, those are my emergency supplies. She had a moderate neighbor. <laughs> We're in a bad stop. We're in a bad spot. Okay, good, good. So we have four out of fifteen secret stashes. Let's demash. I'm looking for Barber Crisp or whatever it's called. I can help you in the cloud. Not for long though. Programmers digest. Oh my, I didn't even notice that on the back there. Let me pick that up again. That's some high quality textures there. <laughs> That's really cool. Alright. Take that. This crouching's hell on my knees. Why? Because you're old? Was that nothing? It's actually, a piece of tile. Okay, so we've been through all of this area. Where's the heck? Where the heck is the way out of here? <clears throat> oh, we gotta go straight into the right over here. Gotta go here and then go right. Yeah. Yeah, this is where the cage was at. Okay. All right. Um, I think we've pretty much looked at everything in here. Um, there's some barbecues right there. All right. Now we can go to the fountain. Or I can still have him in my party and we can go and check some of those other areas that were cut off by uh, the fog. Which I think we could probably go and do. We probably should do that before uh, going to the fountain. Because um, there might be some good stuff in there. I don't know. There was a couple of areas that... Um, couple of areas that were um, blocked by the fog. Wait, who's he shooting at? Where'd you get that gun? I don't remember giving you that gun. Yes. Come on, misfortune, please. Nope. No misfortune. Um, okay, I wanted to check, I wanted to check my barter. So that minus means we're taking a penalty by something. Oh, alcohol withdrawal, that's what it is. Well, I guess we got a drink now, boys. Um, vodka. That's why my barter wasn't working. Is it that? Uh, okay, so there is stuff over here. Let's go check this out. Not sure if I've been in here or not. I don't think so. Poison cloud. Have I been in here? I think I have. I mean, I've opened a lot of doors and stuff in here. Got a lot of doors opened up in here. Ah, ammo box. There we go. Nice. Whoa! Take all that. Don't dive in for too long. Only so much I can do to help. Okay. Getting real tired of tourist season. No offense, but you guys are lowering the bar. Let's see if we can find uh, a kitchen that we can. Build stuff in, I guess not. Okay. Alright, there was that area. Um, which one is this one? 
That requires a key, so we can't go in there just yet. Um, believe there wasn't anything in this area. No. Okay. Uh, let's take those. <clears throat> okay. So there was some stuff in the medical area that had um, smoke and all that stuff on. Residential, it's that way. Cloud okay. wasn't always here. Grew over the years, even without cars or factories. Did we go in here? Yeah, we already did. Okay. That is the residential district. Have we been in there yet? Did we have to go in there? Oh yeah, duh, that's where we got um that's where we got uh Domino. Okay. Getting screwed around here a little bit. Alright, so wait, not yet, sir. Let's go over here. Let's go back into the medical district and let us find some uh Let's find some toxic areas that we can uh, enter uh, and see if there's any good loot in there that we missed. Like in here, for example. What's next? Take that. What was that cosmic knife? Don't dive in for too long. Holy crap. Long, but only so much I can do to help. Hard to see in here. Oh, the door in here. Oh, heck yeah. Okay. What do we got? What do we got? I don't know what I picked up there, but I picked up something. There's another... Oh, no, never mind. Nightstand? Getting real tired of tourist season. No offense, but you guys are lowering the bar. Did I check this yet? No, I have not. I actually haven't been in this area yet. From the looks of it. Teddy bear. Nothing else there. <laughs> we can drop down right here. <clears throat> Go ahead and do that. Town square is that way. I think that was the only the the only major area. That had any toxic cloud, I think. Uh, I don't think anything yeah, over here had it, uh, the cloud. Maybe it did, though. I don't remember. Nope, I don't think so. Alright, let's get out of here, then. Um, guess we'll go back to the fountain and see what Father Elijah wants us to do. Then we'll take it from there. There might be a couple more uh, toxic areas around, um, around like the police station area, but it's fine. <clears throat> Can always look at those a little bit later. Kind of want to advance the story here a little bit more. Uh, police station. Well, but I mean. It's a really small area, though. I mean, we can double check it. I guess we might as well since we're here. Sinclair's little gifts. Watch out if you see a prize lying around. Don't go through the gate to Puesta del Sol yet. Gather the others first. Okay, Father Elijah. Ah, trap. All right, we haven't been over here. Both those are empty, and I open them up like a dingus. 
Okay. Poison cloud in here. I like how when I want to find a place to cook my food now, uh, I can't because <laughs> we haven't come across any cookers yet. How did that go off again? Please, man. Okay. We're not heading to the ballistic. Let's see if there is any more. Is not getting any younger. <clears throat> any more? Oh yeah, I see a toxic cloud right in front of me here. Did I open that? Okay, let's see what's in here. Got a cloud residue. Whoa, acoustic guitar? Uh oh. Let's get injured over here. What can I do with an acoustic guitar? Grenade. An acoustic guitar, you say? Is it a. Yeah, that's a miscellaneous item. Okay. <laughs> I'll, uh, I'll keep that. How many stim packs do we have? 20 stim packs. Okay, cool. Uh, let's go ahead and drop down. Take a look over here. I don't think there's any more toxic clouds. Let's go up this way. This will be the last little bit of area that we check around here. Um, and then we'll head to the fountain. Ah, here we go. Yeah, let me make some of that. Sierra Madre Martini. Right. How did I miss these? Cloud wasn't always here. Grew over the years, even without cars or factories. Dropping some a little bit of lore right there. All right, let's go to the fountain and see what he wants us to do now. That didn't take too long. Where is the uh? Down square this way. Vodka has worn off. Oh, vodka. Let's drop some cigarettes here. Let's buy more stim packs. I like eight more. Big winner. Okay. All right. I want to see if they say anything to this guy. I can't believe the idiot swallowed his collar. Any interaction at all, characters? Sierra Madre may wait, not me. Looking at him. Nope. All right. Good. Well done. Now for the festivities and your part in all this. The owner of the Sierra Madre, for whatever reason, keyed the grand opening to the gala event itself. Gala, I was saying gala. It needs to be far off in order for the casino doors to open. As I've discovered, one person can't do it. So we have to fire something So off. get your team into position indicated on your pip boy, then trigger it properly. You're so close now, don't let me down. Otherwise. I'll have to rely on the next TT. What is the gala event? A display of lights, fireworks, music in the streets. A pre-war festival to mark the casino's opening. The bomb struck first. Okay. It is of no consequence, only firing the event is. Get the three in position, then travel to your position in Salida del Sol and trigger the gala. After that, the real work begins. 
The real work? What is this, a warm-up? Perhaps you think this is a simple robbery. A cheap casino heist. Kind of. No, this is a heist of the centuries. We're not plundering the Sierra Madre. We're plundering history. Taken from the old world itself. It won't let its secrets go easily. Not without a fight. I wouldn't expect anything less. Uh, how am I supposed to get to the markers on my map? I haven't even checked, but we'll ask. I'll unlock the west and east gates to Puesta del Sol and Salida del Sol. Awesome. Now that you survive the villa, I need to get to my position. You don't need me to hold your hand anymore. But, I'll but, keep but, monitoring but... you via the transceivers through the villa. If I need to offer guidance, I will. Okay, we'll head out then. I'd suggest taking the FEV reject to his position first. Although you may need his brutality and strength elsewhere first. Nah. As easy as the villa was to navigate, the outlying areas of the villa are far more dangerous. Thicker with the ghost people, traps, and toxins. Crap. Use your team as I use you. Listen to your caller. Watch where you step. You are no use to be dead. You've lost Dean's unclean living perk. Okay. Get Dean to Puesta del Sol. And all that. Okay. Dean is gone here. Okay. Next quest, Mixed Signals. So let's read our quest here. There was a lot happening, I know. Um, fires in the sky. Get dog to the switching substation in Salida del Sol. Get Dean to Puesta del Sol rooftop. Uh, travel to Puesta del Sol switching station with Christine. <clears throat> um, now, dog gives us the ability to, um, I think, be careful on traps that we're stepping on and stuff like that. Uh, Christine gives us the ability to give us more time for when our caller is beeping. Human uh, Domino gives us the ability to stay in toxic clouds um, for a little bit longer. Um, I don't know who I should take to where. Like, obviously, you have to use their perks to your advantage, so there might be an area where there's a lot of toxic clouds, there might be an area where there's tons of ghosts, so we might need to clear out some of these areas before we start taking people there, so. Um, I think we'll work at getting, maybe clearing out Vesta del Sol, maybe? Uh, let's take a look at the map here. So this area will connect into this big area over here. And this area pretty much connects to all into there. That's actually huge. Um, hmm. I'll tell you what. We're going to save it. Um, we're going to go enter this area and see if there's any dark clouds that we can see. Toxic clouds. Um... And if so, then we can kind of, like, work around uh, that and who we want to take with us. Because uh, it has to work something like that. It has to. Um, but being as that I don't know, we'll open it and see. Then we can just quick load it and grab who we need. <clears throat> Salida del Sol. Well, right off the bat, there's already one of these guys in here. <clears throat> hmm. uh, honestly, I really think he is pretty valuable. Uh, in terms of the toxic cloud and stuff like that. But. So, are we on our way to somewhere else? A gala event, perhaps? I guess we'll just take... um. We'll take God first, uh, and maybe do that. Well, actually, you know what? No. Th this area, to me, looks bigger than this area. 
And two people have to go in here, so I think we'll just go with this first. Uh, we'll take you first. Was that floating above the fountain, the boss man? The one who put these bow ties on our necks? Sure does like to make a presentation. We should keep it down or else the ghost people are going to swarm the gates. Vera hologram or no. Uh, Vera hologram? You know, the holographic woman? Yeah, don't you? Or... Oh. Guess where the keys got lost along with the oh, rest of the Oh, that's Miss Keys. The bomb hit, huh? Ghost in name okay. and image. Still a looker, though. Got to hand it to Sinclair. Sure can pick him. Well, or get picked. Whichever. Can you tell me about her? Vera was a big star back before the bomb. Not the best actress, but... Well, she had other talents. Nice voice. Nice legs. And For you know the reason, rest. Sinclair, nice bottom. Place, she caught his eye. Once he was hooked, that was it. Had to have her. So made the introductions and guess what? He builds this place for her like some kind of Cleopatra obsession. Wasn't always a death trap. Uh, so you met her before she met Sinclair. Who's this Sinclair guy that keeps of getting course. name dropped? What? Some kind of surprise to you that I knew people once? Used to have my name in lights, all right? Knew a dozen Veras or whatever her name was. Uh, Villa Keys. Figured I could pay Sinclair back. Introduce the two. Guy was a slouch in the dame department. Had to pick up the slack somehow. <laughs> uh, okay. You know anything about the gala event we're supposed to trigger? Supposed to be the grand opening of the Sierra Madre. Lots of lights, music, the works. And he's going to use the gala event to open the casino? But that's interesting. Why, why it sure is interesting. Are you thinking of what I'm thinking? Yeah. Maybe the drain in power. That'll cause the security systems to shut down enough to let us in. But getting back out? No, the place will close up tighter than an opening at the Fronds. Or Danny Parker's sphincter when he has to tip a doorman. Um. So, I mean, he obviously wants to, to get in there and see our Madre for himself. So he kind of wants to work with us, but I don't know if I want to go that route. Uh, it seems kind of evil, yet we don't really know too much about uh, Father Elijah too much. Um, da, 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 da. Why would security shut down for the gala? Right, look, so not everything about the villa was the pinnacle of bright ideas. In order to pull off the gala, old Sinclair had to get creative. The Sierra Madre announcement, for example. Not just for the casino, not at all. The gala's tied to the casino, draws on its power. Might cause it to reset itself, open the doors for a bit like it was supposed to. What do you mean about the Sierra Madre broadcast? Well, Vera's beautiful voice doesn't run on casino power exactly. Her broadcast is tied into the emergency broadcast signal for the Sierra Madre. You know, in case of attack. Well, guess what? The night of the gala event, the emergency signal went out all right. But because the broadcast had been hooked up to the gala event, instead of an emergency signal, you get Vera's voice on the radio. Great, huh? Bombs fell and the emergency signal went out. Yeah, the Sierra Madre's last song, one only a few people are ever going to hear. A little sad, but... What can and the violin do? comes in the background. All right. Um, according to the marker, you're slated for a spot in Puesta del Sol. No, looks like a rooftop in Puesta del Sol. Same in thing. In better days, nice view. Now... It's the last place anyone wants to stand when this event goes off. That place during spring, summer, and fall, 
A little bit in winter is a prime resort spot for ghost people. Not the best of neighborhoods. If we're going there, I'm not going alone. And if you have any bright ideas about telling me to stroll over there, or leave me there, no thanks. No thanks. Any idea why he wants you there? Partner, I'm not <clears throat> sure this guy's operating with a full deck. My bet? Process of elimination, lowest common denominator. He figures the strong man's needed somewhere, even if it sounds like the strong man's two minds about it. <laughs> Plus, I'm guessing wherever old doggy boys needed doesn't need smarts. True. I hope not. Over royally jonesed. Royally jonesed. <clears throat> and the woman, the autodoc victim, what about her? Little Miss Silence? Maybe she needs to be in some place where she can be seen, but being heard isn't important. And me? I've had prime billing in Europe, New York, and this gig doesn't feel like that. Don't get me wrong, I can hold an audience, conduct a score from the rooftops, but I'm guessing I'm the odd man out in this whole heist. Hmm. I'm not following you? Odd man out, dead weight. Someone you need holding the toolbox. But why would you be considered the odd man out, though? The chauffeur driving you to the concert. Any guy with hands is who he needs up on that rooftop. Guess he thinks I don't rate looking like I do. Poor him. Okay. All right, so we got to travel together. Strike up the band. Domino's back in town. <laughs> All right. And then we're going to make our way to the soul place area. That's where we're going to get him stationed up first. So we'll go ahead and get over there. And then I'm going to take a moment or two to get some more water and stretch my legs real quick. Um, then we can come back and uh, see about getting these people to where they need to be. So we'll go ahead and save it real quick. Um, and then, uh, just leave it like that, I guess. So I'll be right back in just a moment.